A barbershop in the community is very important. It's a place that you can come and build your memories with your father, your grandfather, with your son, your grandchild. It's a place to come and build confidence. And confidence is, is the base of everything, man. You know, it's how you're gonna carry yourself throughout the week. It's how you're gonna perform throughout the week. And if we can put that small touch to really boost your confidence with the initial haircut, well, hey, you know, that's where we feel that our importance stands. I'm Carlos Diaz. I'm the owner here at Bros House of Fades, as well as Master Barber. Being a barber for me, I was about 15 or 16, and a friend had asked me to cut his hair, and uh, next thing I know, I kind of liked how the clippers felt, you know, and this is where we landed. You know, the goal for me, is to help build others. I really want to hand off some of what I have got and help build up others and just create an environment to where people can come, they can feel comfortable, they can get their hair cut, they can make some friends and enjoy their week, man. I met Ryan, I'd say four or five years ago. He was referred to me through a mutual friend. I met Carlos uh, through a coworker of mine. She referred me to him and I looked at his work. I went and sat in his chair and I didn't go anywhere else from that day. Where me and Ryan kind of birthed a business relationship was when we realized that we was helping each other regardless. We had such a large clientele, but they were separate. And, you know, being separate isn't as powerful as being together. We're, we're working together. Why work together at our two separate locations when we can bring this into one basket and, you know, really nail the cake, man? My name's Ryan Robertson and uh, I'm a cosmetologist here at Bros House of Fades. I would say a challenge would be not knowing what you're about to encounter. If someone comes into the door, you really don't know what they want until they sit in your chair. There's an understanding that we are running a business. It's almost just inevitable that you become friends with your clients and they become friends with you. You, you begin to learn things about their life as well as them learning about you. So you know, that, that's how I feel like the relationship is and I feel like that's healthy for the business. If you have never been to a barbershop or had the experience, it is a definite must try. There's really no other explanation other than going and sitting in the chair and experiencing it for yourself. I would recommend anyone that hasn't to, to go ahead and do so. It is extremely important to express yourself regardless of how it is you feel. That's one thing I've always felt. That's one thing I was always taught. Be you. Bros House of Fades started from my nickname, they call me bro. So the longer time came, it just kind of fell into place. So even from me to Ryan, you know, we're bros, we're brothers, you know. The people that come in here, everybody's bros, we're friends, buds, homies, you know, however you want to look at it. So it's just, it's a place for the bros, man. It's, it all just kind of, it was fitting. I anticipate the future of Bros House of Fades being the barbershop where you know, no matter whose chair you sit in, you are going to get a great haircut. You're gonna have a personable experience. You'll have a great relationship with the barbers in here. We don't wanna just be the barbershop on the corner. We wanna take over this town, cut in there. So, you know, we want this to be the place everybody goes. And uh, I think we really try hard to make that happen with our work. The barbershop has affected me positively. It has helped me mature. It has helped me grow into the man that I'm growing to be. It has helped me be a better father, a better man, a better friend a better husband. It's gave me a better outlook, most definitely. What makes a barbershop different to me and what makes this specific barbershop different is the fact that we connect to the community. Being able to connect with the youth, being able to connect with people our own age as well as people older than you. Walks of all life and just being the bridge between the community, man, it's, it's really a gift. Building confidence moves me. What moves you? Thank you for watching our new What Moves You segment. Big shout out to Bros House of Fades. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. If you like this segment, click here or here for more What Moves You segments. And remember, life moves us. What moves you?